What's up, everyone? I'm Alex Neff, your real estate resource and host of the Bucks County Living Podcast. And here are three trends that are good news for today's home buyers. While higher mortgage rates are creating affordability challenges for home buyers this year, there is some good news for those people still looking to buy a home. As the market has cooled this year, some of the intensity buyers face during peak frenzy of the pandemic has cooled too. Here are just a few trends that may benefit you when you go to buy a home today. Number one, more homes to choose from. During the pandemic, housing supply hit a record low at the same time buyer demand skyrocketed. This combination made it difficult to find a home because there just wasn't enough to meet buyer demand. And according to calculated risk, the supply of homes for sales increased by 39.5% for the week ending October 28th, compared to the same week last year. Even though it's still a seller's market and supply is still lower than normal levels, you may have to do, you may have more to choose from in your home search. And that makes finding your dream home a bit less difficult. Number two. Bidding wars have eased. One of the top stories in real estate over the past two years was the intensity and frequency of bidding wars. But today, things are different. With more options, you'll likely see less competition from other buyers looking for home. According to the National Association of Realtors, the average number of offers on recently sold homes has declined. This September, the average was 2.5 offers per sale. In contrast, last September, the average was 3.7 offers per sale. If you tried to buy a house over the past two years, you probably experienced the bidding war frenzy firsthand and may have had to outbid uh, on several, you may have been outbid on several homes along the way. And now you have a chance to jump back into the market and enjoy searching for a home with less competition. And lastly, number three, more negotiating power. And uh, when you have less competition, you also have more negotiating power as a buyer. Over the last two years, more buyers were willing to skip important steps in the home buying process, like the appraisal or the inspection, uh, to try and win this, win this bidding war. But the latest data from the National Association of Realtors shows the percentage of buyers waiving those contingencies is going down. As a buyer, this is good news. The appraisal and the inspection give you important information about the value and condition of the home you're buying. And if something turns up in the inspection, you have more power today to renegotiate with the seller. A survey from Realtor.com confirms more sellers are accepting offers that include contingencies today. And according to that report, 95% of sellers said buyers requested a home inspection and 67% negotiated with buyers on repairs as a result of the inspection findings. The bottom line is that while buyers still face challenges today, they're not necessarily the same ones you may have been up against a year or so ago. If you were outbid or had trouble finding a home in the past, now might be the moment you've been waiting for. Let's connect to start the home buying process today.